Hello guys, uh, we shall see the important concepts uh, from the ODVC subject uh, from the unit 1 uh, that is a uh, first order uh, ordinary differential equation uh, one or two questions compulsorily on the Newton's law of cooling for the 5 marks or 10 marks so Newton's law of cooling is the most important topic you can expect the uh, one or two questions from this topic and that can be asked for the 5 marks or the 10 marks and then next first question one question compulsorily on the law of natural growth and decay for the 5 marks so if you be the perfect with the natural growth and decay uh, you can get the 5 marks and then next one question compulsorily on the Bernoulli's equation for 5 marks or 10 marks we have the two types of equation that is linear equations and the Bernoulli's equation so Bernoulli's equation is the most important topic and you can get from one question from this for the 5 marks or 10 marks and the next uh, one question related to non exact differential equation from method 1 2 3 4 so we have the 5 methods but first 4 methods can be asked in this uh, external examination which are non exact differential equation and that is uh, anyone can be asked for the 5 marks or 10 marks if all these questions are asked for the 5 marks then one question you will get from the Newton's law of cooling and one question from the uh, natural law growth and decay and one question from the Bernoulli's equation and one question from the non-exact differential equation. So be perfect with these three topics then you can get the 12 marks from the unit 1. Uh, two questions from the 1 mark questions and 10, question, uh, 10 marks from the uh, long answer questions and then we shall see the unit 2 that is ordinary differential equations of the higher order uh, first topic one question compulsorily on the method of variation of parameters we have this method uh, that is variation of parameters and this is the most important you will get one question from this topic so prepare this well and then next one question compulsorily on Cauchy's Euler equation or Legendre's equation uh, so from these two equations um, the mostly expected one is the Legendre's equation so prepare these two equations and problems on this perfectly then you can attempt one question from this topic and from if you see in the from the unit 3 Laplace transform uh, if you prepare the uh, Laplace transform um, perfectly then you can get the 10 marks and inverse Laplace transform uh, it is somewhat difficult to prepare so prepare only Laplace transform uh, topics uh, topics are like uh, uh, standard functions uh, Laplace transform using standard functions and first shifting theorem second shifting theorem and unit step function and then next uh, Laplace transform of functions when they are multiplied and divided by t this is the most important one and Laplace transform of derivatives and the integrals uh, so from these two topics only uh, the mostly expected questions are there and then next so prepare uh, be perfect with the Laplace transform then you can get the 10 marks then from the unit 4 that is vector differentiation from this uh, the directional derivatives is the most important you can expect one question from the directional derivatives And the next irrotational and scalar potential functions. So they will ask you to find the scalar potential function and prove that it is an irrotational vector. So such type of questions can be asked and uh, all uh, problems related to vector differentiation I explain in my videos. Check those video, uh, videos I will provide it in the description. And then divergence of a vector is also a most important. So from these three one question uh, from directional derivatives and from uh, irrotational and scalar potential functions and from the divergence of a vector you can expect one question from each of these three topics then we have the curl of a vector then problems on vector identities from the unit 5 vector integration we have only six topics uh, in syllabus that is line integrals, surface integrals, volume integrals and uh, Green's theorem, Gauss divergence theorem and Stokes theorem but from this all 
there is no question will be asked from the line integrals but uh, from the surface integrals uh, and volume integrals two questions will be asked from these two topics and uh, there is a less chance of getting a question on green's theorem and but gauss divergence theorem you can uh, get one question from the gauss divergence theorem and from the stokes theorem also you can expect one uh, question so the most important are gauss divergence theorem stokes theorem surface integrals and the volume integrals so from these three topics uh, we have the two theorems and the two integrals so from these two th uh, theorems if you be perfect with any one then that's enough you will get the 10 uh, 5 or 10 marks and from surface and volume integrals be perfect with any of the one topic then you can get the 5 marks from this topic so this uh, so from the unit 2 uh, uh, we, uh, we have also the homogeneous equations non homogeneous terms of the type uh, we have like e power ax sin ax and cos ax and polynomials in a x and e power a x into v of x and x into v of x and this uh, these topics uh, we have the many combination of the questions uh, so prepare all those well you will get one question but be perfect with the uh, variation of parameters and the legendary equation so this is the overall uh, uh, concepts from the all units uh, so be perfect with all this I explain the videos watch those and mostly you will get the questions uh, from the videos which I explained so be perfect with those videos and I will also provide the important questions from these uh, first, second and fourth and fifth chapters I will provide it in the description uh, practice those problems well and all the best for your exam thank you